Hi, I'm Charles from Viratex Australia. Uh, we're here today showing off the Viratex EB140 edge bander. Uh, this is a perfect edge bander for the smaller size cabinet shop with sort of a one, two, three man operation. Um, nice and compact, fits in uh, to any workspace quite easily. Available in single phase and also three phase. So if you do need to use it from home, you can use that if you don't have three phase power. Um, this, this machine's got a touchscreen control, so we can um, set all our glue temperatures and things like that. Um, check settings of the machine in the controller here. We've got our feeder which opens up. Inside we've got our gluing station here, which is uh, fully Teflon coated, so non-stick. Uh, pressure rollers, front and back guillotine system, uh, top and bottom flush trimming, uh, and it does have some little flat scrapers on the end there which you can turn on and off. Um, very simple and easy to use. It's also got a uh, panel support here at the front, so if you're doing larger panels, you can pull it out, um, and that just helps to support those bigger panels and make it a bit easier for the operator. This machine does need um, air. It's a pneumatic machine. So as you can see here, we've got our air pressure up the top here. That tells us we're um, at our correct pressure. Machine's now flashing, telling us that we're at temperature and we're ready to run. So we can turn that on. We get our panel. That's our panel, easy as that, nice and simple. Uh, not too noisy as well, so the uh, trimmers will not cut in until it gets activated by the first micro switch. So that helps to keep your noise down. So if you are operating it from home, you don't have a big loud machine to disrupt your neighbors. Uh, with this touch screen, it's got some really good features. Um, your basic standard one would be your glue temperature. So we can see what our current set temperature is and what our actual temperature is and we can change that if we want to. So if we want to change the temperature of that, we can do that nice and easily. Uh, some of the cool features this machine's got is it's got like some diagnostics and things like that. So we can click in here, oops, sorry, wrong screen. Information, and we've got settings and maintenance and issues. So if you do uh, have any issues with your machine, you can go through and have a look at the various different um, issues that you've got. So we'll go with this one, the tape is not feeding. And then it'll tell you basically what's going wrong, where's it getting stuck, it asks you like a few questions. And if you click on it, it tells you where to, to look at to fix these problems. If the tape's getting stuck, it tells you where to do the adjustments and things like that. Perfect for when you're, uh, you know, sort of don't want to pull out the manual or don't want to call your uh, technician to come and have a look. You can give it a crack and try and fix some of the issues yourself. Um, maintenance, so if we want to do glue replacement, it'll tell us step by step how to change the glue in the machine. So it's really simple, really good. Uh, not many machines on the market have this kind of um, information on it. So super handy um, if you need to know how to do some adjustments and settings and things like that. Uh, so adjusting this machine is really simple and easy when you're going from one thickness edge tape to another or different um, sizes. So quite easy and simple. Uh, the good thing about this machine also, it's got some really good stickers along the back there, which uh, help to show out and give you a bit of a reminder of how to do things if you do forget. But quite easy, we just re release the lock here. We've got a, a digital counter here, which will read the thickness of the edge tape. So currently we're on one mil edge tape. And then if we want to change over to two, it's as simple as winding that up to two mil edge tape. Really simple and easy. Do that there. Lock that off. Then we load in our edge tape. So then we come to our guillotine system. So to load this in, we have to turn our air supply off. Push in the guillotine. We can feed that through our strip guides and then adjust our strip guides to make sure that they're set correctly for the, the right thickness of the edge tape. And you can also set these guides here up and down. So once that's set and it feeds through quite nice and smoothly, it's a case of just 
starting it from the beginning there, beginning of your guillotine, um, and now your edge tape's loaded up, ready to go. Then we come down to our glue pot. So we wanna make sure that we have glue in the machine. Um, you don't wanna overfill your glue pot, but you also don't wanna let it get too low. Um, you wanna to keep topping it up with fresh glue. This helps to prevent the glue from burning and um, keeps the glue nice and fresh, keeps it a nice color so it doesn't turn dark and, and leave a last thick line on your edge band, on your edge tape. Um, then we come to our trimmers here. So we've got our top trimmer and our bottom trimmer. So we need to set them according to the thickness of our edge tape and also how much of a radius we want to put on the machine. Um, there's some stickers again on here which show you which way to adjust things and also some rough settings from the factory. Um, or you can also set them however you like. And that's quite simple. It's as easy as rotating this counter. So if we're doing one mil, uh, sorry, two mil edge tape, then we set it to 0002. And then one mil, uh, sorry, the bottom trimmer, exactly the same thing. We always go past the counter and back up. And now that's set ready to run for your two mil edge tape. So very simple, very easy. Um, operator can see what they're doing. If they want to dial it in a little bit differently and adjust it, the trimmers to cut differently, it's very simple and easy here. It tells you exactly which way to turn the knobs and what to turn. Thanks for watching guys. And if you want any more information, feel free to contact your local Viratex Australia dealer and they'll be happy to give you some more information or a price on the machine. And uh, don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel, like, comment if you've got any questions, ask us. Uh, thanks, see you next time.